<laughs> what is up you guys oh my god okay so you might like not really like notice or maybe you will okay let me just tell you so I cannot find my video camera anywhere like absolutely anywhere I've looked everywhere I've searched everywhere it is nowhere to be found and I don't know where it is and I had a whole entire vlog on there like me and my friend vlogged at the mall and it was super fun but I can't find it I can't find the camera I can't find any of it so that's kind of just a lost cause at this point so that's why I haven't been posting videos is because I don't have a camera to film with um, but I'm currently using my brother's iPad so I'm gonna be doing kind of like a um, like a Jeffree Star type video hi how are you like a first impressions video um, because I bought some new stuff and by some new stuff I mean I bought two new things like Jeffrey, you know, usually does a full face of first impressions makeup. But like today we're gonna only be doing two new things because that's all I've bought and that is new and that I haven't reviewed. I guess technically I've used this. I think I used it in like my last video or something. Um, it's looking very crusty right now. But I didn't really like review it and I didn't really like take the time out of the day to like really look at it and see how good it is. Yeah, let's just get started. Um, I'm gonna go damp my beauty blender, which is looking very bad, to be honest. Like, there's foundation on here that's so old. The only thing is, the only issue is I can't get it out. I've washed it multiple times and I can't get it out. I've also used the beauty hack where you microwave this for like 30 seconds and it's supposed to like get rid of the bacteria. So, as you can see, I'm like breaking out everywhere. Um, we're gonna try to cover that up today. So, yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so we are back. I have dampened the beauty sponge. It's slightly bigger than before, I guess. There's cat hair all over it, which is just fantastic. I'm actually not gonna use primer today because I feel like it really clogs my pores. And I know that's sort of what it's supposed to do is like make your face look nice and poreless by like clogging them. But I feel like that's what sort of made me break out last time. But it also might've been the bacteria that I was literally shoving into my face. So I guess we'll never know. But for today's video, at least, I'm not going to be using primer, I'm just going to go right in with foundation. Which also brings us to our first, first impressions product of the video, I guess, out of two, uh, is I bought this 2-in-1 Milani Conceal Plus Perfect Foundation. I've watched reviews on Milani a lot. Uh, I've watched multiple videos multiple times to like refresh my memory. Literally watched one today at school. You know, I heard that they're really good. I've seen YouTubers, I've seen YouTubers like using them and stuff like that. So I was just really excited. I wanted to see how good it was, especially because this is the, actually technically, so I have four foundations. Okay, so this is what the apple, I don't know how to do this. What am I doing? That's what the applicator looks like. It's pretty standard, I guess. Let me first shake it, actually. We're gonna start with, like, that much. I'm also, actually, okay, just so it's like a real, like, Jeffree Star review, I'm gonna apply one half of my face with a beauty blender and the other half with a, um, I guess foundation brush. I think this is for foundation. I don't really know. I've seen one's other shapes, but like this one, I think my friend recommended to me, so I guess we'll try that out. Let's start applying this Milani foundation and see how it works. Okay. That is, I think, one side, one half of my face relatively all complete it's okay you can see that this is clearly like more clear and this side clearly you can still see all my insecurities so yeah so let's try applying it with a brush so we're just going to try on the other side and see if this is any different So, no, I am not using a brush. I, I have a feeling I'm using the wrong brush or maybe it's just an awful brush. I really don't know, but that 
applied it absolutely off, awfully. Like it was just, that was not good. That none of that was good. So we're gonna go back in with the Beauty Blender and just finish it all off. foundation like match just for me like guessing when I was at Target isn't that off actually yeah it's not that off at all when I really think about it I think I'm just not used to my face being so like matte I guess yeah that's the foundation so let me just tell you what I'm noticing so far as if I know anything about makeup like I'm literally sorry so um it's not awful actually okay what am i saying it's really good i like it it actually like it it doesn't like make my skin look too like covered in makeup like you can like you know those makeups like i've used like this one or the other one that i had and it's like you can really really just like tell that you are trying to cover up your face this one is kind of nice because like it's almost like you know it's there but like I have no idea what I'm saying. I literally have no idea what I'm saying. But like, at the end of the day, all that matters is, um, it's good. So let's move on to the next step in the makeup routine. I'm gonna be applying some concealer, and I know that the foundation did say, um, foundation plus concealer, uh, but like, I don't really care, so I kinda just wanna apply my usual that I usually have, which is, can't Stop Won't Stop NYX Concealer. So I'm just gonna apply a little bit right under the eye, down the bridge of the nose, on the chin, and above, right between the eyebrows. Oh, and then one line on the, each side of the cheeks, like right here. Okay, let's go in with the same beauty sponge because I only have one, I also need to buy another one when I go to Target and let's blend this out. What's next? I'm gonna powder my face with this. I don't even know what it is, so like don't ask, okay? Who cares? Literally nobody cares. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. I'm gonna take this and then dip the same beauty sponge again into the powder. Um, and then I'm gonna apply this under the eye. Okay, I don't even know if this is setting powder, if it's baking powder, I don't know. I'm gonna put it down here, right below the cheekbone on both sides. So let me just look at my skin right now and see what we're working with. Okay, I mean, I need to blend out some of that powder up in my eye. I really need a new beauty sponge because this one is just not it, sis. We're gonna do a bronzing thing, I guess. I don't know, blush, probably not. Uh, so this is my relatively new e.l.f. bronzer and blush palette. Um, I put the little plastic back on it because I like keeping things nice and fresh. Here they are, so there's like a blush on this side and then a uh, more like bronzy type thing on that side so I'm gonna go in with my sculpting brush with the bronzer and apply this to the cheekbone okay I went in a little harsh there so I'm gonna try again okay now let's try the other side Oh my god, there's literally literal cat hair on this. Okay, I'm gonna try on this side to apply with more like light pressure. Okay, never mind, that ended fast. Um, let's try to just shear it out a little bit. Okay, I think that looks rel relatively decent. I don't even know. Um, I'm not going with blush. I'm just not feeling that right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this away. I think I think this is pretty good for like, just like neutral 
tones, I guess, for people. Um, it's nice. It's nice. It's e.l.f. It's cheap, so that's lovely. Uh, what's next? I... I have no idea. I am gonna put some matte finish setting spray on just um, to act as a base for the rest of the makeup. So I think we're gonna go in with the eyeshadow. So I am gonna, once again, I'm not gonna open the James Charles X Morphe palette. I might next week for the dance, I don't really know. But we're gonna go in again with the um, NYX Professional Makeup Ultimate ed Edit, whatever the heck, I don't know. Got this at Target as well because Target is my house. So I'm just gonna, let's see what brush is better for this. I think I'm gonna use this side of the brush right here, there it is, to pack this pink um, onto like the, oh wait, I'm not packing anything. Eh, we'll see what we can do with this. I was gonna put it into the outer corner and kinda go in, I guess. I don't, I don't know what I'm saying. Oh my god, I'm like breaking this brush. Okay. Ew, kind of disgusting, not gonna lie. Let me just lightly dip into it here. Okay, actually I think that is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bring this across the crease all the way to almost the inner corner. Like that. Okay, anyways. Now I'm gonna just do that to the, I'm gonna try to mirror it to the other side as well. I'm gonna try to do like a half cut crease today, which um, scares me to a little bit of death because I've never done that before. It's also my sophomore project to learn how to do one and I'm like really falling behind on that, but whatever. You know what I also need to get? Eyeliner, because that would kind of like fix everything if I could just like learn how to do that. Um, so, um, what are we gonna do next? I actually might need to go get a paintbrush so I could apply some, try to do a cut crease, so I'll be right back with that. With a toothbrush! I am out of breath because I just ran down to the basement to get this paintbrush here because I don't really have like the right brushes to do a cut crease, but like I thought a paintbrush would just make do. Okay, hold on. Hey. <laughs> Guess what I'm doing right now? I am filming a YouTube video. Yeah, on my brother's iPad. <laughs> yeah, this is literally what's happening right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, what was crazy was like, I thought by like the looks of what it looked like, like his eyeshadow, I was like, oh, that's gonna like not look very good. And then he like turned on the lights and I was like, wait, <laughs> like, wow, he really snapped. Um, so I just went and did this half cut crease off camera and not gonna lie, I think it looks pretty not awful so uh yeah we're gonna go in and try to do the other one while this one dries and then we can try our third and final first impressions product of the video okay so also i'm using a paintbrush i said that earlier but i'll just say it again okay let's try to do this <laughs> just like ruined this one like from a distance it's like decent but like in reality like close up you can kind of tell that it's like not good at all I literally I don't know what to do with this right now because like I want to put this over it right but like it's kind of wet right now so I feel like I kind of need to wait until it like dries <sighs> this isn't gonna get much worse because I kind of just ruined the whole thing I can't wait until I make a video that actually like looks good Okay, here it is. Pretty exciting to use it. The thing is my eyes are still like wet, so I feel like I'm just gonna like ruin this brush or like this applicator. Okay, 
Okay, it doesn't look like there's kind of a lot of product on it, but like I guess we'll just see what we get out of this. Let me turn it to the other side. Bitch! <laughs> Why are you mad? Cause my pussy pops to be late. Oh, absolutely not. Because like my eye is like still wet, um, I kind of like, it concealer got on this and I'm kind of like ruining everything, so that sucks. Um, but so far I'm not really loving this, um, because like when I pulled out the like applicator thing, it like wasn't, there wasn't a lot of gold on it. The foundation, I'll just end this video here because it's kind of long. The foundation, amazing. It is Kaylin Boyer approved. Not that it needs to be, because nobody cares, but still. Um, this, on the other hand, I'm not going to give my complete, I'm not going to say that it's approved or it's not approved. <laughs> Yet, again, doesn't matter, but I am irrelevant, so. Um, yeah, so I'm not going to say anything about that yet, just because I'm pretty sure I, like, used it wrong. Um, and I put it on to, like, wet concealer, which is, like, not good, so. Yeah, anyways, I'm gonna end this video off here. I'm tired, I want to go to bed. <sighs> this video will probably be up this weekend. Hope you enjoyed, make sure to subscribe if you're new. If you're not new, make sure to like the video. If you are new, like the video. Okay, everyone watching this video, like, share, comment, share, subscribe, do all of that please because I need your help. <laughs> um, yeah, so thank you guys for watching.